of St. Patrick's Day, we have a little video. This is a family of singers from Ireland. We found this video, and they call themselves Crystal Swing. Please enjoy them. Hello, everybody. My name is Mary. I'm Derek. And I'm Dervla. And collectively, we are known as Crystal Swing. Senior Jose works all day, swimming in the red hot sun. Roll after roll, everybody knows what they do when the weekend comes. He drinks tequila, she talks dirty in Spanish. That's the mother and, uh, and his, probably her son and daughter. And uh, I, she drinks tequila. She talks dirty in Spanish. That's the, uh, the name of that song. And then they have a follow-up hit, He Drinks Apple Teenies, and She Wonders Why He Doesn't Sleep Over. <laughs> and... Crystal Swing for our St. Patrick's Day show, but I am trying to get him here for Cinco de Mayo. I hope we can get him. <laughs> All right, and a lot of you are wearing green. I see that. That's important to wear on St. Patty's Day. And uh, I'm actually, uh, I have a little bit of green on, and I'm working on getting a green thumb. Yesterday I mentioned I was thinking of planting a garden, and I got so many responses. I, that's what I love about the show. I say something, I put it out there, and then all of you send me letters or emails or, you know, whatever it is, a carrier pigeon. And, uh, and I got a letter from someone suggesting how to grow plants indoors. That was from Snoop Dogg. And I said, no, no. <laughs> no. That's not what I'm talking about, Snoop. <laughs> I got a letter from Jim Lowe from Triscuit, and he says, Dear Ellen, we saw yesterday's show, and you mentioned you'd love to grow vegetables on your set. Well, we think everyone should have the chance to experience the simple joy of growing their own vegetables and herbs. That's why we at Triscuit are sponsoring the home farming movement. At Triscuit, we know it's simple things that can bring real joy in our lives, which is why all of our crackers start with just a few simple ingredients. We've sent you all you need to start your home farm, and we're putting seeds in four million boxes of Triscuits so that people at home can start a farm too. How that, cool is that? Good luck to you and your green thumb. All right, so uh, I don't think the seeds are just loose in the box. I think it's seed <laughs> it's probably in a packet or something. Yeah, because that would be terrible to just have them loose and then you've got to pick through the <laughs> container of Triscuits for the seeds. But anyway, thank you, Jim Lowe, and uh, I can't wait to grow a Triscuit tree. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to plant, uh, dig some, and I'll put a Triscuit in and then the tree. Um, but anyway, I invited an expert here. Anyway, I didn't know this was happening, but I have an expert here today to show me uh, how, and we'll all learn how to plant a home farm so we can start growing our vegetables at home. And we're going to do that a little later, uh, but right now it's time to continue my quest for world domination. I call it Ellen's Quest for World Domination. <laughs> thought it was going to be the drum part. <laughs> Symbols. Um, all right, well, it's not really world domination. I want to correct. It's more of an outreach of love, really. <laughs> Let's find today's country of the week. It is the country of the week is Ireland. <laughs> Ireland. Well, what a kawaki dink. <laughs> uh, I want to share some interesting facts about Ireland. And uh, where are my interesting facts, Andy? Where are my interesting facts? Bit of a beard there. <laughs> All right.
right, uh, this is an, a fact. This, there are more sheep in, uh, than people in Ireland. There are six million people in Ireland, and there are over seven million sheep. Nobody knows exactly how many sheep, because every time they start to count them, they fall asleep. <laughs> It's all right. If you don't, if you don't feel it, I don't want it. <laughs> uh, Ireland is known as the Emerald Isle, and green is considered the national color. Most people wear green on St. Patrick's Day, because uh, that way, when you pass out on your lawn, you'll be completely camouflaged, and <laughs> and your neighbors won't see you. So that's really, you won't be embarrassed. Uh, Ireland is known for river dancing. And uh, I would show you, uh, you know I'm good at river dancing, you know that. But I, when I was dancing over the coffee table just now, I think I sprained my shillelagh. So, <laughs> I can't show you. <laughs> I'm gonna let the McCartan School of Irish Dance do it for me.